So in this video, I want to show you what easy UI styles can do for you and your project. Now, I don't know about you, but personally, I find iterating through the UI challenging and really time consuming. I might like what one aspect of the UI looks like, but then I want to tweak it. Maybe I want to change a different font, change the spacing, change the size, change the color. And I like that, but now I've got to change it in 10, 12, 15 other places on my uh, UI, and it takes a lot of time. And that's where easy UI styles can come in and help you iterate through your UI designs quicker and easier. So let me show you how this works. So what Easy UI Style does is allows you to define a UI style in a custom editor window and then apply that style to individual UI components in your scene. So if I go up to my window menu and go to Easy UI Style Manager, it's going to open up this custom window. And I'm just going to dock this to the side to make it a little bit easier first all to see what's going on. Now what you can see at the top is a drop down that allows you to select all the different components of the UGUI system. Also, with this update, with version 1.4, Easy UI Styles also supports Text Mesh Pro for text, input, and the drop-down components. But let's start with the text component. I have several text components in the scene that are using this first menu header style. And what Easy UI Styles does is allows me to quickly iterate. So for example, if I want to change the text color, I can change the text color here in the editor, and all the text components that are using this style in the scene will change at the same time. Uh, this allows for a quick iteration, and you can see how one small effect will change your entire scene. On the left-hand side of the style, you can see a series of toggle buttons. What this does is controls which of these options or which of these settings are going to get synchronized with this style. For most people, you're going to want to synchronize all the settings, but maybe, for example, you don't want to synchronize, say, the font size. So if I unclick the font size, now if I change this, nothing's going to happen in my scene. But if I come over here to my resource panel, I can now change the size of an individual object because that setting, that font size, is not getting synchronized with that style. If I come back in, turn it on, it's going to get synchronized. And then just to make it a little bit easier, if, you, if there's only a few things you want to synchronize, you can click the button at the top to toggle all the synchronized options like so. Let's take a look at how this works with images. So on the right hand side of the game view, you can see a series of icons. And they all have different images. And so what I have here is a yellow icon, a purple icon, and a blue icon style that have been assigned to those buttons. But I'm not synchronizing the image. So they can all have their own image on the image component in the inspector. But I can still control their style as a group and as a defined style in our Easy UI Style Manager. So let's take a closer look at how these styles get assigned in the inspector. If I go to one of my images here, you can see that I've got this component here, which is the Easy UI Style Chooser. And what this does is automatically recognize which UGUI or Text Mesh Pro components are on that object. And then you get a drop down menu where you can select from all the different styles that you've defined in the manager. If I change these, you can see that the icon changes color. This makes it really easy again to iterate and design your UI quickly and easily. Let's take a look at a slightly more complex UI component like a button. If I click here on this Save button and I scroll down to the Easy UI Style Chooser, you can see that there's two options here. One is for an image style and one is for a button style. Now it's important to know that these are just controlling the components themselves. So the image style is controlling the image component. The button style is controlling the button component. Now in my inspector, if I open up the button, we can see as expected, there's a text component as a child. Now, if I click on that, that object as well has an easy UI style chooser. So it's important to know when you have a more complex UGUI or Text Mesh Pro object, these easy UI styles are only controlling the components on that particular object and not on the children. This again gives you a little bit more fine control of how to style your buttons. Easy UI styles really is that quick and easy to use. If you have any questions, look for the support link on the Unity Asset Store page, or if you're seeing this on YouTube, look for a link to my Discord server in the video description below.